As you work in Lightroom, it's not uncommon to use color spaces that are not optimized for the web. Adobe RGB is not going to be a big shift, and that's pretty common, but many people choose to work in Pro Photo. This color space is very problematic on the web. Let's go ahead here and take this image and export for the web. I'll save a JPEG like before, but I'm going to make sure that I set the color space here to Pro Photo. This might be the default you have because you were working with images and intended to hand them off to another image editing program. Now let's export that. Let me show you what happens when you view that image in a web browser. It's going to look very strange. Now what will happen when we open that image up in a web browser is the colors may shift a little bit. Things are going to look a bit muted and not hold up quite as well. If you really want the best results, take more control here. When you go to export, what's important is pay attention to the color space. To get the most accurate results for the web, you want to stick with sRGB. This is going to convert the colors to what is expected by the web browser. Stick with this option and you'll get more natural looking colors in the image. Some photos are going to be more problematic than others, but sRGB is the correct color space if web output is in mind.